Okay, welcome to learning the basics of Onshape. Uh, in this video, we're going to set up your units, open a document, and orientate, or orientate your view. When you log on to Onshape, you'll be greeted with this, although you won't have all the documents I've created previously. In the right hand corner, you'll see your name. If you click on your name in my account, under here, you can select your preferences. We're going to be working in millimeters to 0 0.1 accuracy degrees, which is the same 0 0.1 accuracy, and kilograms to 0 0.1 accuracy. Once you've done that, make sure you save your changes. From there, click back, and we're going to create a document. So you click create, document, call this wherever you like. And it's creating a public document. Now sometimes we can choose to have these private, but for the case of this we don't need to. Now, you should have a mouse outside of your Chromebook. You don't want to be using your trackpad for this. If you hold the right hand button, you can look around these squares that are on the screen. If you use your scroll button, you should be able to zoom in and out, and it will always zoom in and out to where your mouse is. So changing where your mouse is changes where you zoom in and out on. In the right hand corner you have a dice. This is really useful because if you get lost a bit, <coughs> like I am here and it's down towards the right hand side, we can use this to reorientate. If I click on the little box here, I can get an isometric view and it will recenter the box in front of me with the lines at 45 degrees. I can then use the right hand mouse button to look around. If I'd like to look at the top surface, I can click on the dice, click top, and it will bring that into shape. I can use the arrows to slowly move around. So for example, I'm looking at the bottom, or again, I can move around like so. Zooming in, zooming out, and the right house, right house mouse button. The right mouse button. 